check 8.25, which is set x, y points. We're going to want to add methods, which are called set x and set y, to our point class that's already given to us. Each method should accept an integer parameter and change the point object's x or y coordinates. Because remember, whenever we make an instance of this, right, it's an object. So we're basically going to change this in x and in y as if it were private. And going along with that, remember, we can't modify these directly. So we have to set a method down here that does it for us. And that's going to where that's going to be where our um, public because it's going to be accessible outside of our method void because it's not returning anything. And then set x comes in here. We are going to be passed in an integer x, right? And we want to just set our field x to this x. So this dot x is equal to x. And if you don't know what this is, we've explained it before, but quickly going over it again, uh, if you have two of the same variable names, the this will grab the field name instead of the immediate value or the immediate uh, name, variable name here. And that's pretty much all you're going to need to do. So repeat this for y as well. So we'll do set y, and this is going to be int y, and then we have this dot y is equal to y. Let us submit that. Let's see what we get. It's running our our tests now, and we've got seven out of seven tests. So that's how you would do that. If you want any more problems, they're all in the description below the like button in the playlist. We go over all these problems and talk all about them.